So we're back, uh, it's day three. After about uh, three or so hours of sleep, we're ready to keep running on it. Um, we have had some binding issues with our slide, so we have another slide potentially coming in, but we're trying to balance out this one to see if we can solve the problems. Yeah, so essentially what we had was uh, the slides down here, um, we moved uh, up a lot further so we could separate the, the load and uh, balance, er, uh, balance it out a little bit over a greater distance. Um, we were getting a lot of issues trying to to pick up any load that was greater than one tote last night. And um, so with this system, uh, just moving that alone, we changed the uh, the amount of force down to a reasonable amount. Um, we got anywhere from, uh, you know, like uh, five pounds of force to be able to pick up one tote down to about 55 pounds to be able to pick up three totes in a recycle bin, um, which is probably going to be reasonable for us. Uh, so we're going to go forward with this. Uh, we put some new um, wooden sticks on Ellie so we can break those again. And um, we're going to keep going on this and try and get our motor in place so we could get a working forklift pretty soon. Whoever designed that is an idiot. Right, so Mine doesn't. Back on. It'll work. Not even close. Not. No. No, it won't. Open the pneumatics. Just really? drop them yes. the score zone. Oh. Clear. Good night. <laughs> <laughs> This is what's known as a catastrophic failure. Now a robot, we broke it. <laughs> no, it didn't break the robot, I'm tired. No, now it's an FRC robot. Yes. 